Alright YouTube, I have dropped off uh, Steve and Elena, or Elena, my bad, and oh my god, I tell you what, GPS was wonderful getting to New York, however, after having been here, absolute dog shit, absolute dog shit, all I can say. Alright, well, once we, I gotta stop and eat somewhere, so we'll do a little intro video, or yeah, an intro video, do a little update then because we're going into the Lincoln Tunnel right now. And it's a little too dangerous to drive and report. So, catch in a couple minutes. Peace out. Alright, so I just got out of New York. Surprisingly enough, it does not cost any money. Well, not really surprising, because who would want to go to Jersey? But it doesn't cost a penny to go from New York to Jersey. But it costs 8 bucks on the Lincoln Tunnel and the George Washington Bridge, which I had never been in either. Uh, not terribly fond of Lincoln Tunnel, but that's just because... Uh, I don't like being underground like that and a river. So I'm not terribly fond of the aspect of drowning. And I'm sure, oh, it's perfectly safe, too, curious. You're just a pussy. Well, whatever you want to think. But yeah, I'm in New Jersey now. I was on the turnpike for about half a mile and had to pay 90 cents. Uh, kids, turn down the speaker. you New Jersey fuck you uh, but yeah again this TomTom -tom GPS is exquisite until I got into the city even in the five seconds it took me to turn twice to get onto the Lincoln Tunnel and go under a few things it fucked up like three times and oh my god but whatever I guess there's just too much freaking steel and concrete and shit but whatever but yeah, so we are on, I don't even know anymore, we were on 95, now I think we are on uh, 280 West, which I'm hoping intersects with Interstate 80 at some point, because that's a road I want to get back on to get home, and, god I hate New Jersey, it fucking stinks man, I wish I was lying, but New Jersey literally smells like armpit ass and burnt hair, ugh, anyways, Thank you, New Jersey, for nothing. And, uh, yep. Like I said, we're probably going to stop. Well, i got to have to stop and get gas here sometime in the near future. Stop, get something to eat sometime in the near future. So, it is now 4.09. So, we are in New Jersey, heading home at 4.09. According to my GPS, we should be home at 10.38. But if I stop and eat and stop and get gas, and maybe I have to go to the bathroom at time because I'm old and can't hold it. It's probably going to go a little bit longer than that. Probably 11, close to midnight. But anyways, like I said, we'll update in a little bit. Later, guys. Update. As it turns out, I-80 and uh, 280 are actually the same road. And uh, 280 just turned into I-80. And we're getting closer to the Delaware Water Gap. Which is so fun to drive over. We'll get to see it this time because it was so dark when I drove over it last time. So yippee. Sounds like some fun. Alright, later. Again, coming into New Jersey via the Delaware uh, River Gap. No money. Leaving New Jersey. In other words, we have to pay to get out of New Jersey because it sucks so bad. Ugh. There's a toll. I'm rolling up to the toll booth right now. This is going to be a lot of fun. Easy pass. And cash. Well, these are all easy pass and cash. Alright, guys. I just wanted to say thank freaking God we're back in Pennsylvania, my native land. Alright. Thank you. Alright. Thank God. Thank God. We're getting to the New Jersey, the armpit of America. By far the worst state in the Union. Oh, let's see it. It's gonna be official. Pennsylvania welcomes you. That's right. You are welcome for getting out of the asshole of America. That is New Jersey. Alright guys, now that we're back in Pennsylvania, I can feel safe to stop and eat something without having to vomit. So I'm probably going to stop and get some uh, gas and food. It's about 5 o'clock. And hopefully if I can pull over in the next uh, 20 minutes to half an hour, I'll avoid the dinner rush. But, wait and see what happens. Alright guys, I'll date you in a bit. Okay guys. 
because we stopped at McDonald's because it was convenient and it was like one of two places to stop where I pulled off to get gas and I didn't feel like Subway or Arby's, so I got McDonald's. Little known fact, McDonald's is the breakfast of fat asses. Anyways, but yep. Mighty Quarter Pounder, fries, wonderful sodium filled ketchup, and Dr. Pepper. Can only validate coming to McDonald's by getting a salad or having a Dr. Pepper. Alright guys, actually this is Diet Coke. So, Diet Coke. Yep. Good stuff.